Hey guys, yesterday we saw Apple release iOS 11.2.2 to the general public to address some of the vulnerabilities within the OS. And of course, today we see 11.2.5 beta 4. Now this software comes in at 52 megabytes, give or take, if you're coming from beta 3 to beta 4. There's a few issues that were addressed in this software release for developers, and there's a few things I wanted to cover, so let's go ahead and get started. Let's go to settings here quickly, the build number 15D5054A. It's going to be the longer build number and of course we still have the feedback application on springboard which means we could be looking at another beta or two before its official launch i'm thinking about another beta maybe beta 5 by the 12th and then we'll see a gold master by the 15th or 16th if not official release we'll have to wait and see apple has been a little unpredictable when it comes to beta releases lately but we're also hoping for 11.3 which is set to bring some of the bigger features and improvements to ios such as iMessages with an iCloud iMessages with an iCloud we've been talking about it forever still not present in ios 11.2.5 beta 4 we'll have to wait and see what apple will do with that feature will they scrap it all together or will they bring it with 11.3 that's yet to be debatable now there's one pop-up i did receive with this latest beta and that is this pop-up here that says icloud library will be deleted in three days i'm not sure if you guys have ever seen this pop-up it's the first time i see it it's telling me to make sure i have a full copy of my original photos and videos i saved because it has been disabled i'm not sure if apple is going to be officially disabling icloud photo library entirely from ios but it's the first time I see this pop-up and I did turn it off and turn it back on and tested other devices and it only gave me this pop-up on 11.2.5 beta 4. Now there was one issue last week with beta 3 on 11.2.5 and that was sound locking your device using the keyboard using the number pad it was really loud well that has been addressed see there the volume is all the way up it's not as loud as it was last week if you didn't catch last week's video I'll link it down below so you can see what I'm talking about but it was super super loud when you tap on numbers and keys or locked your device so that has also been addressed and that about brings in into this video hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you on the next one peace